I do when my punts shank off to the left and are off to the right. In this video, I'm gonna talk through a few mistakes young punters make that cause those issues to occur. The first thing you wanna think about is getting that ball to the shelf right away. Too many times punters walk with the ball in the middle of their body and then they push it out to the side or they push it out, but it stays in the middle of their body. You gotta catch and mold that ball right over your foot and keep it the same level, the same distance every single step. One of the big keys is to catch it wherever you get it and set it right away and then leave it there the entire time. Make sure you're not tossing the ball out to the right or you never actually get it out to where your path of your swing is gonna take you. The next is the position of the drop. Too many times if we're shanking off to the left if we're right footed, the nose of that ball turns in too much. When it turns in or the ball moves inside, because as a punter, you want that ball on your hip. If it moves inside, I can only swing to left to go get it. So it's gonna push my ball off to the left. And if the nose is turned in too much, it's gonna be harder to spiral it. So I'm gonna come up on the back of the ball and it's also gonna push off to the left. Now for pushing it off to the right, a lot of the times, we are swinging so hard that we're missing the sweet spot of the ball. When you over swing with the path of your leg, you tend to swing inside more. So take off a little power so you can allow your swing to stay straight up and through. When you swing hard, you're coming up under the ball and swiping at it, and now you're hitting the inside part of the ball, which is gonna push or shank that ball off to the right. 